Chapter 2. What God is like. When we look at the wonderful world God made, we can see that God is very powerful and, and knows how to do everything. Only such a God could make the amazing world we live in. The Bible says that God is everywhere at the same time. God knows all God knows and understands all things. God even knows the thoughts we think. Because God made everything, he owns everything. When you draw a picture, it belongs to you. Whether you make something out of wood, paper or cloth, you own it because you made it. It's the same way with God. Because God made everything, it all belongs to him. This is why God is also called Lord. It means that he is the king or owner of all that he has made. God created it, so he owns it. The Bible tells us that God is good and, every, and very kind. Just look at all the beautiful things that the Lord created. God could have made all flowers to be black and white, but instead he made them in pretty colors. God could have made all food taste horrible, but instead he made it good to eat and it smells wonderful. He made all sorts of fruits and flowers, bugs and butterflies, colors and sounds, just, to, just so that we could enjoy them. God did this because he cares for us. God loves us. The Bible also tells us that the Lord likes The Bible also tells us that the Lord likes things done in a right way. Wouldn't it be confusing if one day the sun set in the middle of the morning and didn't rise again in 3 days for 3 days? Think how long you'd have to stay in bed. That's why God made rules. He made a rule for the sun. It was to rise in the morning and go down in the evening. It was to, it was to do that every day without changing. God made rules or laws so that everything would fit together and the world would work in the right way. God made rules for people too, so that we could live happy lives. Sometimes we don't like rules, but just stop and think for a moment what the world would be like without them. If there were no traffic lights, no stop signs and no speed limits, you wouldn't know when it was safe to cross the street. Everyone would be confusing and upset, confused and upset. Without rules or laws, life would be difficult and dangerous. God made rules because he knows what is best for us. He knows what when things he knows that when things are done in a right way, we are happy. God cares for us. Everything God made was perfect. When we say something is perfect, we mean that there is nothing wrong with it. It is good in every way. God created a perfect world because that's the way God he is. He is perfect. God never that's does anything wrong. God's home is perfect. It's called heaven. The Bible tells us that heaven is a very beautiful is very beautiful. It's like a huge park with trees and a river. Right in the middle of this park is a wonderful, clean, safe city where nothing is broken or even wears out. This city is so amazing, even the streets are paved with gold. In heaven, there is no sickness, sadness, or death. There are no weeds, thorns, or thistle. No bad or unkind people live there. Everyone is always very, very happy. Heaven is full of beautiful music. The, ama the animals are tame and friendly. You never have to sleep in heaven. There's no darkness or night. 
It is always day. Heaven is a perfect place where perfect people and perfect angels live with a perfect God. It is so wonderful it's hard to describe. Imagine being able to take the to take a peek into heaven. What do you think it would be like to live there? Dark.